Julia. Are you looking for Cruz? As a matter of fact, I am. Uh -huh. He's at the hospital. He's uh, checking in on Laura. Well, is he going to be back soon? It's very important that I speak with him. Uh, he should be back any minute, Celeste. We, uh, we have to go to court. Court? Michael's preliminary hearing. Ethan managed to set that up in record time. What? Oh, how is Michael doing? Physically, he's fine. Emotionally, it's like a truck ran over him. You know, I can't believe this. This whole thing is so out of hand right now. Well, you and I know that, and I'm just going to have to convince the jury of that. What exactly happened with Laura? I've heard all sorts of wild rumors flying around. She fell down, she hit her head in the boat. Michael was found standing over her holding a gun, the gun that was used to kill Leo Mitchell. You know, Michael didn't kill Leo Mitchell, Julia. Well, that's what we'll be maintaining at the hearing. I don't know what his chances are. Why? I thought you said that everything was circumstantial evidence. Well, Ethan has managed to dig up some eyewitness out of the garbage. All right, all right. Can you get me in to see Michael? Celeste, I don't really think I can do that. They're only letting the immediate family in and Cruz and myself, but that's only to talk about the case. But that's what I want to do. I want to discuss the case. I want to help get Michael out of here. You tried. The, the memories that you had that night are not admissible in court because they're hypnosis-induced. I understand that, but there may be something else that I can do. That is, if Michael will let me. Tell me. I have to ask Michael first. Please. Julia, just find some way to get me in to see him. <laughs>